Oh, welcome, Wolf of Wolf X. We are back with the absolutely sublime Dreams on the PlayStation 4 Pro. And I mentioned in the last video that we were going to play through some Mario or Knack type levels today. But I think what I'm going to do instead is I'm going to search for Pac-Man levels. Because I remember playing a game on the PlayStation 1. I can't remember what it was called. It might have been called Pac-Man World, but I could be completely wrong. But it was a 3D platformer. And you played as Pac-Man, and if I remember correctly, it had like fruits that you could get as collectibles. You had those little like pips that Pac-Man always eats that were like spread around the level for you to collect. And the objective was to rescue all of your family members, and it was like a 3D platformer. I don't know if it had bosses or enemies, I can't remember, but it was on PlayStation 1. So I'm going to search for Pac-Man levels and see if anybody has potentially remade that game but I can't remember the name of it, so I'm just going to search Pac-Man and see what comes up. I'm going to assume that I'm going to get loads of results that have like the Pac-Man arcade game, but yeah, I think it was called... I'm pretty sure it was called Pac-Man World, so we'll search Pac-Man and see what comes up, and if Pac-Man World comes up or not, we'll, 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 we'll search Pac-Man, and if, if uh, it doesn't come up, we'll search Pac-Man World, because I think it was called Pac-Man World. Oh, brilliant! Ah, oh, I, I, I love the, I love the Dreams community. It's like every single game I have thought of so far, somebody has potentially made a level of it. Ah, <laughs> oh, this is it must be called Pac-Man World then. It looks like it, doesn't it? Yeah, because it was a 3D platformer, and I remember playing it on the PlayStation One. I never owned the game; I always rented it from my uh, local game shop, and uh, I never ever finished it. I think I only ever rescued because I think you had to rescue like Baby Pac-Man, the, the kid. The daughter and the son. I think you had to rescue like Grandpa Pac-Man. What the hell is that? Jesus. I think when it says short in the corner, it might be like a little animation or something or a little video for you to watch. But I don't really do that. I only play games on this channel. Maybe if any of you guys want me to react to like a short movie that someone's made, let me know in the comments. But I'll primarily be doing games on it. Damn, looks like it's quite a few actually. We've got Pac-Man World Demo right there. We've got Pac-Man World Remake. Might have to check this one out. I think we'll just go through them in order. So I think we're going to spend this video going through Pac-Man World uh, levels. I'll tell you, if you haven't played Pac-Man um, Pac World on the PlayStation 1, go and play it. It was an amazing game. Like, it might be a game that everybody hates, but I personally loved it. <laughs> but I also love Knack, and everybody hates Knack, so I'm probably not the best judge of, um, <laughs> of a good game, but, you know, never mind. Right, so this is made by Jawless Panther. Pac-Man World Demo. Let's see the full credits. Jesus, that is a terrifying imp, ain't it? Beautiful. Not too many people worked on this. As always, all of these people are people that have made like various assets and audio and music and stuff like that, you know. And then you can take all of people's creations and build it into a level yourself. Or you can make everything yourself if you wanna. But it's up to you. Right. I'm not going to give it a thumb up yet, just in case it's awful. For, for this to be, um... Oh, oh, such an iconic sound, innit? Just reminds you of the arcades, doesn't it? Like, every time I go to South End on Sea in England, I mean, there's quite a lot of arcades next to the seaside, and practically every seaside in England has got tons of arcades next to it, but South End on Sea has got especially lots of arcades. And uh, you go into the arcades and you can hear all the different machines going and stuff, but you always hear that Pac-Man noise. No matter how much audio is going on in these arcade places, you can always, your ears always pick up that iconic Pac-Man sound. <laughs> oh, lovely. Oh, look at that. Look at this. He controls beautifully. The animations on him are amazing. Look how his arms move when he walks. Like, some of the characters in this game look very, very stiff. And I don't mean that in a kinky way. Like, they, do, they just seem to move really stiff. Look how he walked. Look at his feet. Oh, he's only, he's only moving one foot now. Oh, if, if, you, if you press it really gently, he only moves one foot. It's like he's got a limp. <laughs> oh, that is beautiful. Right. I'm just going to be quiet for a minute so I can edit out the uh, PlayStation 4 Pro's fan. So let's just... It is absolutely infuriating how loud that PlayStation 4 Pro's fan is. It is infuriating. I don't mind when I'm playing video games on my own, 
But when I'm recording videos for you guys and girls, it's a right pain in the butt because I have to try and edit it out. Man, the, the jumping is beautiful. He jumps brilliantly. Collected a couple of cherries. Yeah, I, I must have remembered this game perfectly then. Because I remember playing this on the PlayStation 1. Like I said, I only ever... Oh, shit. I only ever rented it from the uh, game store. I never actually owned the game. And I remember... I think I rescued Grandpa Pac-Man. I remember rescuing, I think, a, a baby. Might have been a baby Pac-Man. Possibly the son and daughter Pac-Man. But, um... Yeah, no, I don't remember ever rescuing all of them. And I can't remember if the game had, like, enemies and bosses and stuff. Or if it was just a game where you run around collecting things. Can't remember. I'm going to assume that's a checkpoint. I hope it is. And I guess these things right here are supposed to represent the little pips that uh, Pac-Man eats. <laughs> oh, this is fantastic. This is fantastic. This game's only been out for... I mean, if you want to include the people that got the full game early, if you bought the early access, then it's been out about a month now. But it's been out for a month in two days officially, because it came out on Valentine's Day. So, uh, yeah, only in a month, and you've already got beautiful stuff like this. And they plan on, like, this is supposed to be a 10-year project. So could you imagine what people have created in 10 years once people get used to all the tools and stuff, and then Media Molecule release, like, new tools? And I'm going to assume that when the PlayStation 5 comes out, they'll release a PS5 version that might have possibly even more tools. Who knows? Man, it's going to be amazing. It's going to be utterly amazing. Definitely a game I'll be able to come back to quite a lot. And even if I stop playing it for a while, we can come back to it in like, I don't know, six months or something, and then there'll be like a million new levels for us to play. Oops. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Did I turn the TV down? No, I didn't. I wondered why the music sounded very loud. I can't normally hear the music because I have the TV on practically mute. <laughs> Hopefully you don't hear an echo now, because that will be a problem. I have to restart the whole video. Oh, come on! There we go. I really didn't think I was going to get any results. I knew that I was going to get, like, results for the art. Oh, crap. Oh, I'm, I'm alive! <laughs> I knew I was going to get results for, like, the, um, the arcade version of Pac-Man, but I didn't think that anything would come up for this. I weren't even sure if it was called Pac-Man World. God damn it! I need to stop rushing. But yeah, we'll play through all of the different Pac-Man uh, World levels. I like playing through uh, levels like this. But yeah, I think what we'll do in the next video is I'll probably search for Mario. I already know that there is an absolute ton of Mario levels. Uh, I haven't searched for Knack, but I'm going to assume that somebody has at least done something with Knack, because we all know Knack is the greatest character of all time. Oh, I've got one pip. Or do I have to go that way? No, that leads back to the beginning. I feel like I need to jump down there now just to get those pips. We're going to leave them. We're going to leave them. Is the strawberry the final thing we need to collect? Oh, oh, we can come down here. Okay. Lovely. I think I might have to eventually play... Because um, somebody's remade the PT demo in Dreams. And I think they've remade it very, very well. So maybe I'll play that in one of the videos. Because I, uh, I know Tom Wolf will probably want to see me do that. If you haven't subscribed to Tom Wolf yet, make sure you go and subscribe to him. He isn't uploading much at the moment because he's very busy. But um, when he does upload, they're always great videos. So make sure you go and subscribe to my good friend Tom Wolf. He's been a top guy lately. He's been helping me through a lot of the stuff I've been going through. So uh, make sure you go and subscribe to the top man, Tom Wolf. I didn't pick up that strawberry, so I'm a little bit annoyed now, but never mind. But that was a fantastic level. Obviously, not much was going on, but just... Whoever made that um, Pac-Man puppet, they're called puppets in this game, so I'm just going to call them puppets, but it's like the characters. But whoever made that uh, Pac-Man character, you did a beautiful job. Absolutely beautiful. Utterly amazing. He controls beautifully. And how he wobbles his arms when he runs. So many characters in this game that people have made are just really, really stiff. Like, they don't seem to really move that fluidly. But um, he does. <laughs> right, I guess we'll try this one now. Pac-Man World Remake. I mean, this one's got the most ratings of all of it, so. Yeah, I'm going to do both of them anyway. Oh, oh this one looks like it's going to be the best one of them all. It's even got ghost enemies. This one looks a lot more like the game, because I remember there being a, um, a level that looks like this. 
and they also made the pips look a bit more like balls. And they've also got the bigger fancy ones as well. And I, th I think these might have even been in Pac-Man World and they made you like temporarily immune. Man, I need, I need to find it. I need to try and find a copy of Pac-Man World and set the PS3 up and then maybe make a playthrough of it. Because it's another game on PS1 that I never finished. Similar to... Um, oh, let's check the credits as always. Oh, look at that imp. It's a ninja. Look at that one. It's like a little panda bear. There's so many imps you can get. I'm just using the one you get from the alpha or the beta or whatever it was. But I need to find a copy of um, I need to find a copy of this of the game and maybe do a playthrough on YouTube because I, I haven't finished it. Sort of like how I never finished Croc or Bomberman World and a few other games. Oh crap! It's not even in English. <laughs> oh no! Is this the same? Is this the same? Uh, yeah, I think it's the same character, isn't it? I think it is. I guess we'll find out by walking slow. Oh no, this might be a different model actually. Yeah, I think this might be a different Pac-Man model. Because he isn't doing that strange walk. Right, have I got an attack button? No, I'm going to assume I can kill... Oh god! Look how fuzzy they are! Oh crap, I can't pick up the balls. What's this all about? What the hell? What's going on? What are you all doing? Hello friends! Oh you want a cuddle? That's what you want! Oh it's a family friendly Pac-Man! Oh mwah! Mwah! God's sake! Can I at least pick up the cherries? Oh no there's another one! There's a lot of ghosts! What the hell? Is there a button? I was, I was excited to play through this level, to be honest. I'm, uh, I'm uh, quite disappointed now. I can't even eat the balls. That sounds proper filthy. <laughs> I do not eat balls. At all. So, uh, none of that in the comment section. None of that. Don't, don't start with me. <laughs> <laughs> B-Wolf eats balls. Oh, it reminds me of a very hilarious song I was listening to. Oh, I, think, I think I heard... Um, I think somebody, I was watching one of Sips' live streams and I think somebody uh, donated to him and suggested he listen to it. I can't remember what game he was playing, it was some sort of farming game, it was a little while ago. And then he listened to it and it's a song about sucking on balls. It's a, it's a black dude, an old black dude that sings it possibly, or it might be a young black dude, it's definitely a black dude. And uh, it's pretty much just singing about women sucking his balls <laughs> and uh, him putting his dick in their booty hole. You might know the song I'm talking about. It's a very, it's a, it's a very funny, flipping song. Definitely not family friendly. Now punch the parrot. Oh crap! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> I mean, to be honest, if the ghosts look like this, I don't think I'd be scared of them either. I mean, look at that. That is a dog. Look, it just wants a cuddle. Look. Oh, that is a. Oh, there you go, my friend. There you go. Mwah. Is that what you wanted? Are you feeling sad? Have you been deserted on this deserted island and you're all lonely? You want a friend, do you? There you go, my friend. Have a cuddle. There you go, mate. We all need a cuddle sometimes, don't we? It's not nice to be treated horrible, is it, my friend? No, it's not nice, is it? Everybody judges you because you're a ghost and they just don't understand what you're going through, do they? They always think you're a bad guy. But that's all you ever wanted. You wanted a cuddle. Because that's what people don't realise. In the arcade version of Pac-Man, the ghosts don't have arms. So they're chasing Pac-Man because... They want Pac-Man to give them a cuddle. The problem is, though, Pac-Man also doesn't have arms in the arcade version. So, uh... You better not be ruining my thumbnail, ghost. Right, this could be my thumbnail. There we go. All my thumbnails seem to consist of me playing platformers, don't they? <laughs> there we go. Right, I'm going to have to leave this level now because we can't actually do anything. I'll give it a thumb up just because it's a beautiful level, but it would be nice if I could actually eat the, uh, eat the Tic Tacs and stuff. Right, I'm going to assume that this is the only other one. I'm not clicking on that because that looks terrifying. Pac-Man in Lofi Island. What is Lofi? That's like music stuff, isn't it? Because you always see those streams on YouTube, don't you? Right, it doesn't look like there's anything else. We, I mean, we could play through the original Pac-Man after. Right, let's click on this and if this is uh, rubbish, we'll go and... 
will go and check out the uh, arcade version. Play as Pac-Man, the legendary gaming icon, as he appeared in the Pac-Man World series. So it's definitely called Pac-Man World then. Version 0.5, added a HUD that displays health, work in progress, knockback system, health wedges, hazards, various fixes coming soon, boxes, world map, pack village. Lovely. As always, let's have a look at the full credits. It's made by V-J1109, and there's probably a lot of other credits. Oh, no. Did it all by himself? What a legend. Right, let's give it a play. Can I punch things then? Oh, yes! Oh, no! Slow down! <laughs> Rev roll test area. Oh, look at him. Look at his little pose. Look at him. He thinks he's a right little badass, doesn't he? Look at him. Looking all smug. Oh, yeah, you can charge up the dash, can't you? Oh, shit! Oh, steady! Metal pack power up. Mini pack power up. Not quite sure how I'm gonna do this one. <laughs> no point asking me, mate. I got no bloody clue. We got some oranges and some cherries. Bounce damage trigger test. Oh shit. <laughs> Feels like a training course for Pac Man. Damn. Oh yeah, you could like butt stomp on people. Look at that. Wouldn't want Pac Man doing that to you, would ya? Whoa, flipping hell. It's very sensitive. Oh, steady. All right, that didn't go very well, did it? I think there's, like, is there... Oh, here we go. Finish some walls here so we don't kill ourselves. There we go, beautiful. Looks like it leads to a dead end, but never mind. How long can we roll for? Or is it indefinitely? Nope, it does run out of energy eventually. Whoa, flip it. Oh, damn, I nearly killed myself then. Man, this is great. But yeah, whoever created this, actually, all three of you creators that were working on your own Pac-Man levels, collectively, all three of you could easily remake Pac-Man World. Very easily. If all three of you worked together, I reckon you could remake the full game. Really easily. Because the first level, it was actually a proper working level, but there wasn't any enemies or anything really going on, but you could collect things and it had checkpoints and stuff. The next level was the visually the best one and it actually had enemies and all the things looked correct, but obviously you couldn't actually collect or do anything. And this one's got all the mechanics, like the damage and the moving and the attacks. So all three of you guys could, or, or girls could work together and actually rebuild Pac-Man World. No, get on it, get on it, do it. But open a fucking Patreon, I'll pay you. I'll pay you all 10 quid a month or something. Get, get it done, you three. Get me my Pac-Man World remake. Don't worry about Namco, they don't mind, they don't care, they want you to remake it. It's not like they plan on uh, remaking Pac-Man World, is it? Right, that's that then. I suppose we can have a quick go of the... Oh, oh get, I've, got, I've got rewarded for thumbing people up. I always thumb people up because... Oh crap, didn't mean to do that. But uh, we'll check out the original uh, Pac-Man level now, the arcade version. And then in the next video, I'm going to check out some Mario levels. Because I know there's supposed to be some very good ones. Where is it? Here we go. Not sure how well this is going to work. Oh, the creator is online as well. I'm going to give it a thumb up. We can already see it's going to work. Shadow, Speedy, Bashful, Pokey. Lovely. Right, let's get this done. I am terrible. Oh, I say I'm terrible at Pac-Man. I did manage to platinum Pac-Man World. Oh, it plays beautifully. I think it's got the correct audio as well, isn't it? Man, I, I, I platinum the uh, PlayStation 4 version and the PlayStation... Uh, I think it was Miss Pac-Man and possibly basic Pac-Man as well, like normal Pac-Man. I platinum both of them on the PlayStation uh, 3, so... Oh, was it 4? Oh, shit! <laughs> that has got to be the most agonising noise in the world, isn't it? It's like nails on a chalkboard. 
I've never been good at Pac-Man. I'm not, I'm not the worst player in the world, but I'm by far not the best player. Go away, Pinky! Oh, shit. Stop being so clever! Stupid ghosts! I've got one... I've got, well, I've got no health left now, technically. Right, we've got two of these power pips, so we should be alright. There we go. Is that going to be the end now? Is this the same level? Oh no. Nope, we are carrying on. It's level number two. I'm not sure how long this is going to go on for. I'm going to assume they haven't remade all the levels. Does Pac-Man have an ending? It does, doesn't it? It's like, what is it, like 99 levels or something? Oh, that was close. Go away, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. Oh, go away! No! Ha! Get ourselves a strawberry. Oh, damn it, it left. That's it, that's the thing I like. What the hell? Oh, come on! Oh, well, never mind. I, I probably failed uh, just in time, to be honest. That's pretty damn good, that is. Alright, I already fumbed it up, didn't I? Alright. Alright, I'm going to end this video now, Wolf of Vets. But yeah, I am very happy that somebody actually knew the game. I was expecting it to not even have any, any 3D Pac-Man uh, levels. I didn't even know if it was called Pac-Man World. I just assumed that that's what it was called. For some reason, I'll, I remembered Pac-Man World. But yeah, thanks for watching Wolfabets. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. And to the creators of these levels, you did beautifully. Every single one of these Pac-Man, Pac-Men, um, controlled beautifully. And the levels were all great in their own ways. So if you all, all three of you team up, you can, you can get this game done. Or at least make a fantastic level that gets like a bajillion likes. And then hopefully wins an Impy Award. <laughs> but yeah, thanks for watching everyone. Like, share and join the pack today.